My name is uh, Thomas Sullund. I'm the CTO and co-founder of uh, Spin Robotics. We initiated this Trinity project because we got more and more customer requests for even more flexible systems that, uh, than we are producing today. They uh, really wanted to have uh, screwdriving systems that was uh, less dependent on, on fixtures so that they can produce uh, uh, more different and various uh, products in their production. The benefit from using uh, SpinEye here is uh, that customer gets uh, even more flexible screwdriving systems. They uh, are not dependent on the fixtures anymore and uh, can easily use and program the robot by using camera technology. My name is Lazaridis Lazaros. I'm from Greece and I'm working as a machine learning engineer for DCube. DCube uh, is producing uh, robust uh, quality assurance solutions in multiple industrial uh, environments. Uh, using artificial intelligence and uh, machine vision. Uh, the goal of the cube is to reformulate the, um, the production in smart factories. My role on the Trinity project was actually to integrate the camera and the lighting system to the robot and then to train the required algorithms, the artificial intelligence algorithms, to be able to detect holes on PCBs. And uh, there are a few steps in order uh, to be able someone to build a, a robust neural network and a robust artificial intelligence system. So for example, I can use this one. So for example, the first step for this project was actually to define the region of interest, where are the holes of, uh, on a PCB. So the next step is, and this is the most time consuming step, is actually, and actually has to be done by a human being is to annotate those holes and uh, what I mean with uh, the word annotate is actually to put few tiny boxes around the region of feeders where are the holes. My name is Markus Lecour and I am a robotics engineer here at Spin Robotics and my role has been to work uh, with the integration of the camera to the robot and to our screwdriving tool. So this Trinity project is combining a screwdriving robot with a camera system. And uh, on the camera side, we have some artificial intelligence um, which detects holes in PCBs. And uh, from that, from the position of the holes uh, in the pictures, uh, we can use some hand-eye calibration on the robot between the screwdriver tool and the camera to figure out where in the world these holes are so that we can insert the holes without having to teach uh, the position of the holes manually. Uh, without uh, the use of a camera, uh, the robot does not know uh, where to move without being taught uh, where to move. But by putting a camera on the robot, the robot is able to, with the help of the camera, find out where the holes for screw insertions are and then uh, inserting screws into them itself. The contribution of the D-Cube in the Trinity project was to create robust and cutting edge uh, artificial intelligence algorithms uh, in the paradigm of uh, detecting uh, screw holes on PCBs. Uh, the goal of those algorithms uh, was actually to uh, allow a robotic actuator that is employed in an assembly task to be able to detect the holes and to put uh, screws on those holes.